All right, so right now I'm going to do uh, create an image, um, kind of freeform style, just kind of make it up as a go, which is one of my favorite things to do on pro this program, Paint. Um, so yeah, I kind of have a general idea of what I want to make, um, but the details will just come to me as I go. All right, so let's pick a background. Let's see, let's go to edit color so I can pick a different shade. I want to get a good prehistoric shade that'll kind of give you some foreshadowing on what I want to make overall. Let's see. Let's see. Remember to click the little bucket here. Fill that in. Whoop, that didn't work. Hold on. I gotta click. I gotta click right here. That's right. Okay, so let's see. There we go. Alright, so now I'm gonna bring on some images. Go to paste, paste from. <coughs> Let's see, start off with dinosaur. Okay. I remember transparent selection, then I'll make it blend in with the background here. Okay, let's make this guy a little bit smaller. Not much. There we go. Alright. <sighs> Sorry. It's fucking hot in this room. Um, Alright, so now I'm going to bring on another image, paste from, and this is going to be the, the image that I'm going to use to cut out Michael's head. Okay, so I'm going to actually cut this, zoom out of my canvas here, make it a little bigger, give me some room off to the side here. Click paste again. Alright, we got Mikey. Alright, so free form selection. I'm just going to zoom in a little bit here. How you guys doing today, by the way? Didn't ask before, but. Anyways, alright, start cutting around his head here. Mikey uh, has always been known for having a nice hairstyle. He's always got some good hair going on up top. Not sure what kind of gel he uses, but. Seems to, to suit him pretty well. Works well with his body chemistry, it looks like. Alright, so cutting along here. Kind of messed up at the beginning there, but that's okay. All part of the free form style that I like to perform, I guess. Alright, so we're going to need to shrink Michael's head a little bit. Resize here. Actually, before we do that, let me go ahead and just do it this way. Just use the cursor here make it fit the right way yeah. no. make it flip it you gotta flip rotate flip horizontally there we go yeah, it kind of took a chunk of his face out that's okay though kind of helps add a little character to the image all right I think that's good um, so far I like what I see now I'm gonna bring on one last piece of scenery here got some grass all right, that'll go just nicely down here somewhere. Yeah, let's put it off to the side a little bit. Yeah. Let's see, make it a little smaller actually. Let's stretch it out. There we go. Good enough. All right, let's zoom back out a little bit and close this up. Zoom back in. All right, let's get a little text in here. Put some final touches touches on this piece of art. Change the text. Let's do a little bit of a weird text color. Let's see what they got. Let's do. Let's see. Let's do like a funky like orange. There we go. That'll be good. Okay. All right. Now select the text, the font. That you want the uh, that you want to select there. All right, it's paint's not responding for a second. All right, sorry. Okay. Let's see. Let's go with something kind of prehistoric looking like candles. I kind of might fit it. All right, let's call this one Mike. Is 
Spilosaurus? I don't know, Mike like a dinosaur? I'm not sure. Let's actually let's jump on Google real quick. This is another um, tool that you can use sometimes. Uh, Google. It's another. It's a whole another video. I could have a whole series about Google. Google. Um, let's see uh, the uh, dang, like uh, what's what's the word dinosaur something saurus. Saurus. Okay, I got it. U.S. All right, and actually, I changed my mind about this uh, this font. I'm just gonna make it white. See what that looks like. I like that better. It looks looks better. All right, let's resize that to uh, smaller there. Put a little dashes in here. All right, so. Here we are. All right, so this image, I'm going to give a little information on the side here. Add a little special touch over here. Go ahead and change the font, style, something a little more informative. Maybe this will work. A little smaller font size. Let's see, 26. Okay. Okay. Give this a little underline that'll that'll work a little information about the mycosaurus because some people you know i know i'm just, just joking around uh putting a little fake information on here but some people might be curious like what is a mycosaurus like what does that thing do it kind of looks like a dinosaur um some you know some people might be kind of curious about that all right Do that actually because I want this to be a little bit smaller so I can fit some more information on there. there go. Maybe even a little smaller than that. We'll go with a 12. Okay, I'm going to switch. Let's see. Herbivore. I believe I'm spelling that right. touch to this and I think we're done here all right um, what do you guys think I think we're done actually let's let's add one more thing I'm gonna add one final thing I promise we'll be done so today I'm actually gonna show you guys a little quick trick about the shape section first of all you can browse through these see what they got they got a little lightning bolt they got some hearts some text bubbles stars directions that kind of thing but I'm just gonna add a little format to this, make it look a little neater. I'm gonna add a line over here. Make it straight. Alright. It kind of separate the information off to the side, so just you know makes it a little easier on the eyes when somebody's looking at this. They'll actually know, you know, okay this box off to the side must be something special. Alright, and one last thing was Underline on the image there. Alright, and I think we're done here. Once again, guys, you know the drill. <laughs> Leave me a comment, a question. You can even private message me if you like to, um, or you can leave a comment about an image that you'd like to see in the future. But this image is special made for Mike, Mikey. Um, I hope he likes the image for him. I think that, you know, it's, it's funny sometimes to just kind of goof around on here, make a little freestyle image and that's just kind of what I want to show you guys today. So alright, thanks for watching.